Hello guys, today we are going to、um, test the first generation MacBook side by side to the、uh, earliest 2011 MacBook Pro, which we produced the crash on the Mac OS X. Both MacBooks are running Intel chipset, and the first generation MacBook running the Core Duo processors 2 gigahertz with the Intel GMA950 graphic chips. Now we will open the Google Chrome and run the WebGL test. And see all the textures and features loading. We can see that the first generation MacBook runs at about two or three frames per second. We can see a minor problem here. It's about the texture. Which is reflecting in the background. This is not surprising because、uh, the graphic chips is six year old from Intel. That is not powerful enough to run the test. Next,、uh, we will see the early 2011 MacBook Pro. We open the same Google Chrome and run the WebGL test. We can easily search the test in Google. The MacBook Pro is now、uh, low everything on the screen. Textures and the fish, and running at about 60 frames per second. And、uh, we can see、uh, there are some options in the WebGL test.、You、can choose the number of fish from one fish to 1,000. So、uh, we'll now try 1,000. As you can see, there are many fishes on the screen swimming around, and、uh, let's do the same thing on the early 2011 MacBook Pro. Change to 1,000, and、uh, all the fishes pops up on the screen. It is quite smooth. We still have、uh, about 40 to 50 frames per second. Okay, now、um, let's compare two machines side by side and see what's happening in the next ten seconds. We can now look at the right side, the latest MacBook Pro. Now freeze. The fishes are not moving, and、uh, we still can move the mouse cursor. But、uh, when we try to click on any buttons and icons, it's not responding. Any mouse clicks. Keyboard inputs are not responding, including the brightness button and the volume button and different combination of keys, not working. And let's look at the clock. It's 9:37 p.m. And、uh, go back to the first generation MacBook.、Um, still running with that problem. Uh, we just find some missing、uh, textures, and see the time is now 9:38 p.m.
And uh, let's look, look back to the MacBook Pro. The clock still stuck at 9:37 p.m. Again, we can try the brightness button, the volume button. Now go back to the back macro. The time now is 9.39 and back to the MacBook Pro 9.37. Now we close the lead to see if this solved the problem. It's still freezing without any response. And let's look back to the first generation Mac. And uh, quite slow but running. I have taken this MacBook Pro to the Apple Service Center and have uh, three different logic boards but all suffer from the problem. I encourage all of you uh, who have the latest Mac to run this test and to see if your machine is suffered from the problem and uh, make sure you have downloaded the latest version of Google Chrome and don't use Safari because uh, it doesn't support WebGL yet and uh, Firefox users um, may also want this test but um, the Firefox is not efficient to reproduce the problem. Remember not to run any program in the background or run out of programs simultaneously and uh, this is the end of my sharing. Thanks for watching.